welcome to my channel. I just got my winter Stitch Fix box and I'm super excited to show you. This is my third Stitch Fix box and I feel like they finally understood my style and really attuned to my taste, so I really loved everything in this box. If you don't know what Stitch Fix is, it's a monthly or quarterly subscription box. They send you five pieces of clothing after you fill out an online style guide and you get to pick and choose what you want to keep and the rest of it, they send you this envelope and you send it back to them. It's already paid for, so no cost to you. You only pay for what you keep. I'm super excited for this box because I feel like with this being my third one, they finally understood what I would like and my taste and my style. So I have really loved everything in this box. It was really difficult for me to choose what to keep and what I'm gonna send back. So I'm super excited to show you. Okay, I think we'll start with my favorite thing since it's been so freaking cold. Um, they sent this really long, gray sweater and it is so soft and so warm and I absolutely love it I don't know about you guys my office is freezing I'm literally constantly wearing blankets or scarves every single day so I'm so excited to wear this um, and this was this was the PNA dot K Elena duster cardigan um, for $46 so sort of expensive but I feel like well priced for what it is and I'm super excited. To be honest, I've already worn it like an entire weekend. I love it so much. Okay, second item. This isn't very wintry, but I still loved it. Is this black tank top and it has like this little keyhole in the front, which is I think so sexy and playful and cute. And this is totally my style, like long and flowy. I love it so much and I love black. That was the Paper Moon Colby Keyhole Blouse for $34. So pretty reasonable. Um, okay, I'll be honest, these two are my favorite things and they're the two that I'm actually going to keep. Okay, the next thing in the box is this plaid button down and I love plaid. I'm seriously obsessed with plaid. I wear plaid every single day. It's like ridiculous. Um, and I really love this shirt. I think it's so cute. It's long enough. I feel like you could wear it with leggings and it's just cute. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to tell in the camera, but it's like purplish and blue and with pink um, stripes. It's so cute, really cute. The only reason I don't think that I'll be keeping it, it is a tinsel hattie button down top and it's $44. And I think I said this in my last one, and I just feel like I could go to Target and get like a plaid shirt for way, way cheaper. So. I think I'll send this back, but it is really cute and definitely my style, so I'm super excited they put it in my box. Last top that was included in my box is this, and believe me, I thought about this for a very long time. I had no idea if I wanted to keep it or not. I think it's so cute. First of all, it is so soft when you feel it. Like It's like feeling like Nixon's baby blankets when he was little. It's so soft. But it also has this cross stitch like in the front, which I think is really adorable. And I really like it. Um, it's definitely a winter top. You would not be able to wear this in another season. This was um, American Able Barbara Brush Cross Front Knit Top for $38. And I just, it's really cute. I just didn't think I would be able to wear it that much, especially since it's so thick and warm. Um, so I'm not going to be keeping it, but really cute. And the very last thing in my box was this pair of leggings. Which, okay, this is the only thing in the box I didn't particularly like, just because I feel like all of my leggings, I usually get athletic leggings or like the Forever 21 $3 leggings. And these, um, these have this elastic top, I don't know if you can tell. Um, it's kind of weird, and I feel like it was like cinched really weird, where it would like kind of give like a weird breakaway. I don't know. Maybe if you have like really curvy hips, this would be nice for you, but I don't so I don't think it would be very flattering on me um, so I probably won't keep these but we'll see when I try them on how comfy they are and how much I like them these are the MTLA Kristen fleece legging and they are $38 so that's my box I will try everything on and let you know how they feel
what I said about these leggings. These are actually super comfy and I like them a lot. They're just not what you're looking for. If you're looking for and like picturing in your mind an athletic legging, that's not what these are. These are very stretchy. I would compare them more to tights versus an athletic legging that's gonna suck you up. So if that's what you're looking for, these aren't the tights, leggings that you all want, but they are really nice and super comfy. So giving these a second thought. Another note, um, this shirt, although it was really cute, I felt like it was really tight in the sleeves, oddly. Even though it was sized correctly throughout the rest of my body, the sleeves were super tight. So, just a note. But yeah, so thanks for watching. If you have any other ideas of subscription boxes that you guys like, I've actually really enjoyed getting these Stitch, stitch Fix boxes. So if you have other subscription boxes that you enjoy getting, let me know in the comments below so I can check those out. Um, I love making these videos, so... Let me know if you like them and if you'd like to see more. Um, thanks for watching. Wonder where you are, where you wanna be.